cells need energy to do work. This energy can be in the form of chemical, mechanical, or electrochemical energy. For example, chemical energy is used by cells to help build, rearrange, or break down substances. Mechanical energy is used during cell motility, and electrochemical energy is used to help move charged substances across membranes. Cells acquire energy by breaking down high energy molecules obtained from food by the process of cellular respiration. Specifically, this process involves extracting the energy currency of life, ATP, from the food consumed. The reactants in the general equation for cellular respiration are glucose and oxygen, and the products are carbon dioxide, water, and energy in the form of ATP. Although the chemical equation for cellular respiration does not seem complex, there are multiple processes required for this reaction to proceed to completion. Most of the chemical processes involved in cellular respiration include oxidation reactions and reduction reactions, collectively known as redox reactions. An oxidation reaction is a reaction that involves the removal of a negatively charged electron particle from a compound. A reduction reaction involves the addition of this electron to a compound. It is helpful to remember the function of these reaction pairs using the acronym LEO-GUR, or LEO the lion goes GUR. LEO stands for loses electrons oxidized, and GUR stands for gains electrons reduced. The redox reactions taking place during cellular respiration involve the transfer of electrons by molecules called electron carriers. The principal electron carriers include nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide, or NAD, which is derived from a vitamin B molecule called niacin, and flavin adenine dinucleotide, or FAD, which is derived from a vitamin B molecule called riboflavin. Both NAD and FAD are coenzymes, non-protein molecules that help an enzyme function normally. NAD plus is an electron acceptor and thus an oxidizing agent. It accepts two electrons as well as a proton, or a hydrogen ion, from glucose to result in NADH, the reduced form of NAD. NADH can reduce a metabolite by giving up its electrons, thus becoming NAD plus again. NAD plus can participate in redox reactions over and over again. FAD is another coenzyme that is also used during cellular respiration. Each FAD molecule accepts two electrons and two protons to become FADH2. Both FADH2 and NADH are a source of stored energy created during the first two stages of respiration. The electrons carried by FADH2 and NADH are then used during the final stage of respiration for ATP synthesis.